Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1671, where we have 40 moves to collect two ingredients. The ingredients start here, and we have to get them somewhere along here. So we have to get through this frosting and through this popcorn, get them into these portals, and then drop them down, and that's really tough. Uh, especially, you know, the popcorn we have to hit three times, and then these are so high. We do have coconut wheels on the board, but they're so poorly positioned that they're not likely to help us very much, except maybe at the end bringing them all the way down. It, yeah, just ignore the coconut wheels like we have to on most levels. Now, because this is so hard, I want some help on this board initially, and I don't have it, but I know that I can exit and re-enter over and over, and I don't lose any lives, and if I were to bring in boosters, I wouldn't lose any boosters. So that's going to be my choice to do a little bit of finagling here. I can make some stripes, but they're in the wrong direction. I could try to pair them up with something, but again, I just want to start with something solid. I'll have enough struggle as I go. So I'm going to go ahead and pause the recording, and I will meet you back here when I find a setup I like. Okay, so this looks better. I could do a stripe, and that would be good. It would be aimed here, and it's hard to get here. But it's really hard to get up to here. So I'm going to go wrapped and just hope that I can set that with another stripe. And I know I could have messed things up entirely. Uh... I got it, so it's going to get all the way up almost to here, but not quite. And then this is going to set this off. So this is a good first move setup. These are now cleared out. That's significant. That's going to be hard to reach. Huh. Okay, that I'd like to drop down some. I guess these could help a little. Yeah. Ooh, how can I get that out of the way? I don't know that I can. No, but I got that lined up. That's okay. If I do this, I would hit both these popcorn. I don't know how to get that with this. Yeah, I don't see that as an opportunity. And then I'm also going to hit this popcorn again. There we go. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. How in the world? Well, I'm just going to use this to set off this. I don't have enough turns to be fussy with it. Oh, that's so funny. All right, this is what I need. Now, I have one blue aimed here. I need to try to get more because, oh, the way this flows is kind of funky. I'm glad that didn't change things. Oh, and I could do green. I've got three blue aimed here. This is what I need. Because at least one of them has to go horizontally, right? There we go. And now things are flowing through. I've got ticking time bombs set at 15, but I only have 16 moves. So presumably that's not going to be awful. One, two, three. I can strike this again using this. There we go. If I could get this down there intact, I could use it here. We're kind of struggling here. But, let's see. I can get a lot of stripes. I just can't get them where I need them. Well, guess what? I think we're going to blow everything up just to collect that downward and then see what happens. This looks pretty good. This is looking good, folks. I could do wrapped. I think I'm better off doing stripe and pulling this down, and then I've still got this here 
to make some fun stuff. If I do this, how do I pull this through? Oh, I think if I just do this, there we go. All right, so that's how I beat this board. That was my second playthrough for recording purposes. It's a tricky one. It's a stressful one. That color bomb stripe is what saved me because that's how I was able to get up here. So I think you need to focus on making that or bringing it in. You can always bring in boosters. Booster up, baby. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.